Hey everyone, my name is Zhang Wu and I am Vice President of Game Services at Samsung Electronics. Thank you for joining me today to learn more about the Samsung Galaxy Store. I'm really excited to walk you through some of the changes and improvements that we have made to the Galaxy Store this past year. Not only did we give the Galaxy Store a game-centric facelift, but we've combined the live ops, promotions, and exclusive Galaxy Store user benefits that we are known for with enhanced features and tools under the hood to help developers grow and optimize their games within our Samsung Galaxy Store ecosystem. Now before I get into the details, I'd like to give you a quick introduction to the Galaxy Store, particularly for those of you who might be first-time developers in our ecosystem. The Galaxy Store is Samsung's owned and operated mobile app store preloaded on all Galaxy mobile and tablet devices available in 187 countries around the world. What started off as a storefront to customize your device with themes, wallpapers, and fonts has now grown to a full-blown app ecosystem of thousands of developers and hundreds of millions of active users from all corners of the globe. And games have been at the center of our explosive growth, from Fortnite and Free Fire to Genshin Impact and Gardenscapes, the Galaxy Store has become the destination for millions of Galaxy gamers to access the very best in mobile games today. And so, this past year, we've decided to double down on gaming in the Galaxy Store with the aim to build an app store that is developer-focused and developer-friendly. As I mentioned before, we have completely redesigned the Galaxy Store this past year. With our focus on games, we've simplified the UI from four different tabs to two, with the dedicated Games tab getting the spotlight as the default tab when users first enter the store. We also know that getting your games discovered organically has increasingly become difficult with the myriad of game choices that users have in front of them. So we've developed a full collection of promotional placements and designed a cohesive and compelling store experience around them to maximize exposure for your games. From half-screen showcase video banners that give your games the full hero treatment to full-screen pop-ups that put your games front and center for our users, we are constantly looking for new and different ways to help users discover your games. Part of building a developer-friendly ecosystem is our commitment to treating Galaxy Store developers as partners, not just sellers or vendors. Our dedicated team of game partner managers work closely with game partners to not only help troubleshoot any issues, but to learn about and plan for your roadmap of new content updates, features, and in-game events. And not only do we build a promotional plan around your new in-game events and upcoming releases, with many of our game partners, we collaborate closely on Galaxy Store exclusive events and promotions that are wildly popular with our users. We have spent much of this past year building features and enhancements that our users will never see. Developer tools. To be developer-focused and developer-friendly, we gathered a lot of insight from our developer partners on their needs to better optimize their business on our platform. I'd like to highlight some of these new Galaxy Store developer tools with you. We know that paid user acquisition is an important way for many game developers to drive targeted user scale into their games. It was important for us to enable this within the Galaxy Store. So this past year, we have partnered with all of the major mobile measurement platforms and integrated the Galaxy Store as a viable app store destination with some of the biggest mobile ad networks so that game developers and publishers can turn on, attribute, and fully track end-to-end -end paid user acquisition campaigns into the Galaxy Store. Not only has the Galaxy Store design had a facelift, but so has our seller portal, our developer console interface. First, we have made initial onboarding as a new developer onto our platform easier with the adoption of Dunn's number validation. Now you can be approved as a developer within minutes instead of days. Several months ago, we introduced our first iteration of our Galaxy Store Developer API. 
Gone are the days of manually inputting metadata and IEP SKUs directly into Seller Portal. Our developer API will help eliminate the risk of human error by automating these build management data entry processes. Our enhanced beta testing feature now allows developers to upload multiple APKs to a single application name and run up to six beta tests simultaneously. Ratings are important for your install conversion, so we want to give developers agency on when and from whom to prompt for a rating. Our new Ratings API will allow developers to prompt users from within their app or game to provide a star rating. Users can rate directly from within the in-app interface and get back to playing. And finally, our staged rollout feature allows developers to manage the deployment of their game updates to a smaller audience and scale that up gradually so that developers can monitor for bugs, crashes, or other issues before fully publishing. Within Seller Portal, we have particularly focused on several key enhancements as it relates to IEP management. Now, IEP SKUs can be turned active or inactive without an APK resubmission and update. Simply toggle them from within Seller Portal and they will be reflected in real time within your game. Our pricing template feature now eliminates random pricing amounts that typically may occur from applying currency exchange rates normalizing them into localized pricing patterns. Also, in the past, when developers submit IP items, the pricing for these items get converted and locked in based on currency exchange rates at the time of submission. But we know exchange rates can sometimes fluctuate unexpectedly, so we've included a function that allows developers to update their IP pricing to the latest currency rates. In addition to that, our pricing template also gives developers the freedom and flexibility to manually set prices in those geos where local purchasing power and demand may require pricing adjustments. We will be starting a closed beta for these and other enhancements that we have made to IP management in the coming weeks. If you are interested in helping beta test these features with us, please reach out. We would love to hear from you. When it comes to monetization, we have made some significant enhancements with the introduction of guest checkout and an optimized checkout flow for first-time payers. For users who don't currently have a Samsung account, the Galaxy Store now allows these users to still make one-off purchases with our guest checkout feature. Users don't have to go through the account creation process and can make that purchase they want and get back into your game quickly and no more manually inputting long credit card numbers and billing addresses. We have integrated Optical Character Recognition, OCR, to speed up your checkout process. Users can scan the front of their credit cards, have name, credit card number, and expiration date auto-populate in the relevant fields. Then just input your security code and zip code and submit. Users will be able to hop right back onto the battle bus rocking their new skin within seconds. And the Galaxy Store now fully supports subscription-based monetization through our billing platform. The Galaxy Store team is constantly dissecting market trends and listening to game partner needs, looking for ways to better meet them and deliver what is needed for our developer partners to lean into the Galaxy Store and thrive in our ecosystem. Our product roadmap is chock full of these kinds of enhancements, from Android app bundle support to giving developers the ability to A-B test their app details page to optimize conversion. Many of you are creating, innovating, and pushing the envelope of what is possible in gaming on mobile. And we at the Galaxy Store hope that we can be a part of that journey. I am excited about what we, the Samsung Galaxy Store, and you, the game developers, can build together and as an avid gamer, I can't wait to get my hands on all of your games. To learn more about what I have highlighted today, please check out our Samsung developer website. Thank you all for watching, and please enjoy the rest of SCC 2021.